A is another point for the Keshe Foundation. <coughs> what we've done, it has come to our attention that the professor, the head of the chemistry department of um, George Washington University has confirmed the correctness of the technology in capturing of the CO2 and producing nano CO2 the way we have done it. Do we have that paper on the link? The report has come through BBC, reporting it, and the paper is published. <clears throat> there is no problem with such a confirmation of the technology. He uses a zinc plate, he uses everything done. We have a problem with, um, not we, us as a Keshe Foundation family have a problem, and that is his claim this is to be his invention and his discovery. So, uh, we see another Stephen Hawking in hand, but the only problem we inform the BBC is that this technology is filed for sale at $25, 25 euro for, um, for past two years. And you see it, um, it's been published, they found a nanofiber, carbon nanofiber, they've used the uh, CO2 which we create to make a fiber from it the way we do, and so it is very interesting how these this things is still going on, and it's exact explanation and the way we work, using a zinc plates and everything else, and they have put a claim in. So we see we George Washington University needs to um, to be informed. We have informed them. You need to let them know that this technology belongs to the Keshe Foundation Worldwide family. You've been stolen from, again, last time from your children, now this time from scientists claiming to what you do. We have to expose these things because then we can work in a free environment, because if this guy puts a pattern in, all your work is blocked, and you have to run to create, sorry, we did not do, we, it wasn't ours, you didn't claim it. So, you see this is done, uh, we, has, we have to inform and uh, uh, we see it's a copy of all the work you have done, and using every system we have done. Cathode consists of galvanized zinc coat, what we call the chicken mesh. They're giving it a scientific name. So, uh, please understand, uh, here it says, figure three present the action of zinc where they present only a zinc metal on the galvanized steel coating, chicken mesh. You've done it for a long time. Please write to BBC and to the university, you can find their address, chancellors, that, yeah, uh, that um, this is already belongs to the worldwide community of Keshe Foundation, and not to um, another Stephen Hawking, what we call this professor, what's his name? I can't remember his name, it's on the paper. And um, it seems that it's got a lot of collaborations. Now, the beauty with this thing is that now it's confirmed we are correct. It's confirmed by the scientific world, even they try to claim it, that yes, we do absorb CO2. This is from the most leading uh, institute in the world, Mr. Stuart Leach, Professor Stuart Leach. Uh, he's lynched himself actually, instead of lynched. Um, is that uh, now, the people who said there's no confirmation, George Washington University, one of the leading universities in the world, confirmed we are all correct. We are all achieved what they said you cannot. We said you can change it with the hot water, if you remember I told you how you put the copper in and change the copper, you can collect it how you do it with the transition of electricity, or cold water, or whatever, with the salt water. Now, your work is confirmed. We are correct. CO2 is captured, is dissolved, and we see it to be correct. This is a huge confirmation of the correctness of the technology, because nano-coating, absorption of the CO2, was the fundamental base of the technology development. And even if you look, the rings are there, they show the rings how we do now, for the uh, health application. So, your technology, your work, 
is confirmed to be correct. Armen showed us what they are claiming to be, with a low temperature, even in the water, we could produce guns, and we could do it. Alex showed us with a fire, we are achieving the same thing. So, now, you see, how correct, the technology is, how correctly you are working, and why, from now on, we go into the next step, of the development, of the technology. If you go down, you see the peak of the carbon. This is what we showed in the report of, uh, what you call it, um, IMEC. When they analyzed the, the, what you call, the CO2 nano-coated copper. So, Raman shift testoscopy sits within the brackets we explained. We are correct, we've been correct. IMAC denied it, they put their own money inside to steal Mr. Declarations, and now you see, 10 years of work is confirmed by BBC to be correct. You all doing the correct thing. Cash Foundation Worldwide Family is doing what they cannot, they could not, but as a suppression of the news, they put others to suppress your work. As I wrote to the head of the uh, university, this is your job, you have to say what is done, send them the link. That a five-year-old child in China, on a video on YouTube, is making what the professor is doing in a toilet, so his work is good for a toilet. Because a five-year-old child, at least was honest, put it as a cash foundation YouTube in China. In reality, now we can go and, anybody says, if it does, we give them the paper. This paper proves the correctness, independent investigation, confirmation of technology. But it has to be credited to the Keshe Foundation, worldwide family, not to a um, bunch of people, who have taken this technology, and running with it as is theirs. The thing is, I can tell them how they can make kilos of it, but in their report they say, only they can produce nine gram. All of you are using, producing buckets of it. It means they haven't managed to understand how to make the way you are doing it. In the report, nine gram is the maximum, and then the professors at um, Imperial College, they say there's a problem. If they can produce more, then become industrials. I think all of you can send your CO2s to university and say you can have bucket loads of it. We make as much as we like, not nine gram. So, now you received, right to Mr. Slitch at the thing, uh, and uh, right to the other authors, that you have taken technology, this is ours, and belongs to the Keshe Foundation Worldwide. Let them become part of the Keshe Foundation family, because scientists like this will do us a lot of good, they, we can give them other materials to access, but as a Keshe Foundation Worldwide family. They have the facilities we don't have, but correctness has to be back.